Hello, welcome to Storytime with Burley. Today we are reading Dixie Loves School Pet Day by Grace Gilman. Today was an important day. Dixie was going to school with Emma. Come on, Dixie, said Emma. I don't want to be late for pet day. Dixie yipped, she yapped. Dixie didn't want to be late either. Dixie trotted by Emma's side all the way to school. You must be good today, said Emma. No howling or barking. Dixie wanted to do as Emma said. She would try her very best, but it was hard. Dixie, called Emma when Dixie ran after a chipmunk. Emma brought Dixie to her classroom. Dixie had never seen so many animals all at once. There were hamsters and turtles and kittens and lizards. It's a zoo in here, Emma laughed. It's time for pet day to begin, said Emma's teacher. Would anyone like to bring his or her pet to the front of the class? Matt brought his goldfish. Dixie wagged her tail. Thump, thump, thump. Shh, said Emma. Anna showed the class her ant farm. Dixie let out a little yelp. Shh, said Emma. Jason showed off his pet frog. A roo. Dixie howled happily. Shh, said Emma. Dixie's getting very excited, isn't she? Emma, it looks like your pet has something to say, said Emma's teacher. This is Dixie, said Emma. She loves all animals and she wants everyone to know that. Dixie yipped and yapped. She agreed. Now let's walk around the room and meet all the other pets, said the teacher. Emma saw a girl she didn't know very well. The girl had a big cage on her desk with two small birds inside. Hi, Emma said. I'm Emma. I like your birds. Thanks, said the girl. I'm Amy. I just moved here. And these are Nate and Kate. How old is your dog? asked Amy. Emma told Amy all about Dixie. Dixie is so cute, said Amy. Look at how she's making friends with Nate and Kate. Emma and Amy laughed. Dixie was watching the birds. Whenever Nate and Kate chirped, Dixie wagged her tail. Dixie wanted to get a closer look. She bumped the cage with her nose. The cage door flew open. Nate and Kate flew out. Oh no, said Amy. Dixie, yelled Emma, what did you do? Everyone tried to catch the birds. Emma closed all the windows. Amy closed the doors. The teacher tried to catch the birds with a butterfly net. But Nate and Kate kept flying all around the room. This is awful, Dixie, said Emma. Dixie watched. She felt very bad. Dixie let out a sad little yelp to let Amy know she was sorry. Just then, Nate and Kate swooped down. They landed right on top of Dixie. That's great news. Dixie trotted carefully back to the birdcage. Nate and Kate didn't even try to fly off her back. Dixie yipped, she yapped. Nate and Kate chirped and cooed. Dixie saved the day, said Amy. Looks like Dixie made some new friends, said Emma. Yes, said Amy, and so did I. The end. 
That concludes our reading of Dixie Loves School Pet Day by Grace Gilman. Thank you for watching Storytime with Burley. Please like this video and subscribe to my channel, At Home with Burley. Thank you. Bye.